Hi guys, my name is Gina James Cole and we're going to take a tour around the new architect homes that are available in Sims Free Play. These came out around about the 18th, 19th of November and these are the Mayor homes that they asked us to complete and we have got 12 new homes it looks like and they are, yeah, they are all simoleons. We're going to try and get them all done in this video I think. So let's go ahead and take a look. I'm going to show you all of these on a premium size lot. You probably can build these on a standard size lot. Generally, these the homes tend to be standard size lots, most of them. And also don't pay any attention to the prices on mine. So here is the first home. This is a one story and can be built on a standard lot. This is nice. This has got this expensive fireplace in here. It's also got lots of the urban furniture, is it? The urban kitchen there. This is a nice build. Oh, it's got a cuckoo clock. I like that little cuckoo clock thing. Is it called, is it, I don't think it is a cuckoo clock, is it? I don't know. Anyway, moving on. Lots of the SP windows as well. It's got some of the spa doors. This is a nice build. Oh, and it's got this computer, which you all know that I absolutely love this computer. It's got another one of those fireplaces. Are they something like 25 LP or something to buy? I might actually build this house. This is a nice build, it's very simple and there is, oh yeah I was going to say there's no bedroom, there is a bedroom. It's very simple but I like it and you get quite a lot of stuff for your money. It's a, There's a nice uh, stereo over here as well. I might build that. Here is the second house, this is very different looking isn't it? Look at this, so we've got a little basement there, we've got another floor, yep we have, oh we've got a couple of floors, whoa look at this. Very different looking house here isn't it? It's pretty cool though, I like it. Let's take a little look. First floor. Have we got anything rare? Um, I don't remember. Where are these from? I don't remember seeing this chest or these chairs ever before. Have I just not used them? I'm not sure. Let me know down in the comments where they are from. We've got a Japanese kitchen, which is nice. Let's go down to the basement first off. There's not really anything down in the basement. Okay, let's go back up to the second floor. And yeah, that's nice enough. What's this? That's a jewelry box. Is that worth SP or LP, that uh, study desk there? I think possibly it is. I like this house. And up to the next floor. Yeah, nice little house here. Not anything too rare or LPs or anything, apart from those chairs that I don't know where they've come from, but let me know where they are from. Here is the third house, and standard size lot again, and two floors, yeah, two floors. Look at this, this is quite sort of stately, isn't it? It looks it looks like a mayor's house, there's a little pool back there. We've got a swing, a romantic swing over here, a nice little outdoor area. Let's take a look at what we've got inside, anything? Nice. Like all these little pink flowers that are dotted around. These I'm really impressed with these builds. This is a nice build. There's nothing too rare. We have got the romantic bed there, the four poster bed. Let's go upstairs. And have we got anything rare? Nothing rare, but I love the build. Oh my goodness. It is a really nice build. I like these rooms here where they've got like the sofa and the TV desk and like the little plant bit. I really like that. And I like this bit here with the uh, the plants and stuff. This is a really good build. I like it a lot. Has it got a, no, that looked, I thought that was a balcony then, but it's not. It's just like a little corridor through. Good job on that build person who built it. I really, really like that. Well done. I like how they've done like the plants inside and out as well. Same sort of plants. Those topiaries. Nice house. Here is the fourth house, and let's take a look. We've got a little pool outside. What have we got? Anything? This fireplace, is this rare? Or like LPs or something? I have a feeling that it is, but I'm not entirely sure. We've got the urban furniture. Is that urban? The, um, the sofas there. We have got this three little plant. I feel like that is LPs to buy. Got anything outside? Nothing particularly outside. A little barbecue in that. Um, these are really nice houses. There's nothing rare particularly in them. The fire are those fireplaces LPs? I feel like all the fireplaces are LPs. Oh, we've got another floor as well. I didn't realise. Oh, we've got these some of the urban 
um, oh, is it urban? I can't think, let me know, am I set to say, talking rubbish about these that they're not urban furniture, but these sofas are definitely something uncommon. <laughs> uh, we have got the swing, the romantic swing. This vase is, I think, something like 35 LP to buy. We've got a, yeah, this is, this is a nice little build. I oh, look at that cute little balcony there. And this is what it looks like. I love how they've got the uh, easel outside on the balcony. Yeah, nice build. Good job, whoever built this again. Here is the fifth house, and this has got two floors again. Let's see what it looks like. Yeah, very kind of mare looking. These are the first houses that I feel like kind of fit with the theme that we were asked to give. Uh, what have we got? That sun is maybe two LPs to buy. Oh, look, they've got some uh, clothes on the bathroom floor. I love that. Um, oh, look at this back room here. This is fancy. This might be worth building to get the... Do you only get one of these like school things? You might want to build it to get another one of them. And also this dude here. I can't think of what he's called, but he is worth quite a lot of LPs. Let's go ahead and take a little look upstairs. We've got two ways upstairs on either side. And nothing rare, but this is, a, again, a really, really good build. I really like it. There's two bedrooms. It's kind of symmetrical, I think. Yeah, kind of symmetrical. Well, not kind of symmetrical, symmetrical. <laughs> there we go, that is that build. Good job on that one as well. Here is the sixth house, and let's have a look. We've got a, whoa, we've got loads of floors on this one. Let's take a little look at what we have got. So first, oh, look at the, um, the entrance there. Oh, my game's lagging. Oh, stop, lagging. Oh, there we go, right, <laughs> here's the entrance. Whoa, it's really badly lagging, to be honest. So let's take a little look if we've got anything. We've got some of these rugs that are quite expensive to buy. I think, or LPs anyway. Oh, we've got a Thanksgiving dinner table. We've got a bar. What else have we got? Wow, this is quite confusing. I'm kind of just going to look through and see if we can find anything rare or limited. Not necessarily tour around the house. There's a nice little outdoor area here, a nice little pool area. Downstairs, this is really awesome, I love this build. Cool little uh, basement there. We've got some romantic lights outside. How do we go upstairs? Oh, over here. We go upstairs and there's these pictures all on the wall upstairs. This is a really well decorated house. Some more, um, some more of the rug over there again we've got this like school thing that goes up on the wall that you might want to get more of got a science chair over there wow so much stuff in this house this is awesome it's got a little hot tub out here and a balcony that goes kind of all the way round we go up to is that the last floor yeah up to the last floor and oh, look at this bedroom here. This is cool. I love, I absolutely love the design of this house. There is nothing massively worth LPs or anything in here, I don't think. But I might just build it anyway because I really do like it. Let me know in the comments what you think of that house. I think it's really, really good. Well done. I'm really impressed with these houses. Here is the seventh house, and oh, we've got a little parrot in this house. And let's see, anything rare? We've got an elevator there, we've got a hot tub and swing and romantic lights out there. And upstairs, we have some urban furniture, kids' room over here. These Kids toys, I think, are worth LP. So these, like the bricks and the mat and stuff, potentially are worth LP. And maybe this isn't in the game anymore. This bassinet, I'm not entirely sure. And we have like a music room there. Nice build, nice build there, but nothing too rare in it. Here is the eighth house. And look at this cute little entrance here. I love it. Oh, hang on. I think this is two houses. This is two houses. 
on one plot, kind of designed kind of the same. Okay, let's take a little look at them. So this isn't necessarily like a mare's house, but this has got, this is, I have seen this design before. I'm pretty sure, I can't think of the YouTuber's name now, but they've got a tour up on their channel of houses that are very, like townhouses that are similar. If I can remember, I will put the name on the screen now. And I will also link their video to their tour down below as well, if I can find it or remember. We've got some Neo Tokyo stuff there. There is some windows, this SP windows. Um, we've got ice sculpture there. What have we got in this house? Nothing, nothing particularly rare down there. Let's go up to the second floor on them. Then that, it's a nice build. I love this build actually. I think I tried to replicate it myself in my town and then I kind of got bored of building. I was going through one of my phases of not being bothered to build. I've got um, a sci-fi chair there and a lamp. And up on the last floor, romantic bed. Nothing, nothing rare, but a really, really cool, nice build. I love that build. Here is the ninth house, and oh, it's got one of those fireplaces that are worth lots of LP and lots of these SP doors as well. This is a nice build, lovely big lounge area there in the centre of the house. Lots of the urban furniture, huge dining area there with loads of tables around. A desk office area here. This is a nice build. Let's go up to the next floor. We just have a little look outside. No, there's nothing particularly outside. Uh, we've got a couple of bedrooms upstairs. It's kind of, well, it is symmetrical. Again, on both sides. I like those stairs. I think they're my favourite, favouritest stairs in the game. And, oh, we've got a little, oh, wow, look at this. This is cool how, hang on, I need to see this from, whoa, I really like how this is kind of, I don't even understand how they've done this. Let me go back down. I need to check this. I have no idea. Is it just... Oh, it's like a separate little thing there. That is really cleverly done. That is pretty cool. That is, well, yeah, I like that a lot. Look at that. That is awesome. This is the 10th house. House? Half? <laughs> this is the 10th tenth, tenth house. And we've got a fish tank, which you cannot get in the game. So that might be useful for some people. And what have we... Got what else? This is an expensive dog kennel. I have a feeling, I think. It's got like a little fountain in the center. Oh, we've got a basement. Let's go down. Oh, look at this. That's a cool little basement. That's a very really nice basement. Oh, and it's got a little gym area. Oh, no. It's kind of just a storage room where they just chucked all the stuff. The old TV, the old computer, the exercise bike. You know, you buy an exercise bike. It's all good intentions. And you just stick it down in the basement because you don't use it. Uh, let's go and take a look upstairs. Yes, we've gone up. How do we get upstairs? Oh, here we go. At the start, upstairs here. We've got anything there? Not anything. I like how it's designed, though. It's a nice build. I feel like I've said that a lot in this video. I like how it's designed. Nice build. But it is a really nice build. Lots of these sofas are knocking around in these builds as well. Oh, that is a cool computer to have. It's kind of like a, a Mac, and I think that is, well, it is. It's LP, the SPs. And have we got another floor? No, we haven't. Here we go. That is a, a cool build. A little donut house there. Here is the 11th house, and we have a little basement there. So let's take a little look what we have got. A nice... Um, living area there, kind of with everything in. It's got an SP door over there. Let's take a look. We go downstairs here. And, oh, nice little basement area. We've got one of those school things again up against the wall and a foosball table. What else have we got? Oh, a nice little outdoor area here. Check this out. Some romantic lights there. And another little, look at this. This is a really nice... Build. It's got a swing there. Nothing rare or LP particularly though. Let's go upstairs and we have a romantic double double poster, four poster bed there. We've got a hot tub outside. 
Oh, look at this room. This looks very cluttered and kids worthy bedroom with all sorts in it. That's pretty cool. I'm sure something in there must be worth some LPs. I don't feel like I've seen that bookshelf before. Is it still in the game? Let us know down in the comments somebody who knows more about that than I seem to know. And we've got a maybe a teenage girl's bedroom over here with this that I think is LPs, that desk. I like that desk. I never had it in my house, so it must be worth LPs. Oh, and we go upstairs again. And we've got like a kitchen area, lounge area. We've got all sorts up here. Nothing rare though, but nice and there we go that is wow look at it that's a pretty cool build might be worth building for some of you look at it in the back that's awesome and here is the last house let's take a little look oh look at this one this one looks nice let's take a little look inside oh i like this room this ve looks very like a mayor's house doesn't it i think so anyway have we got anything Rare or LPs, we've got the potion stand there that is a couple, or well maybe one LP actually. Uh, look at the kitchen, they've used some of the cottage stuff in the kitchen. Thanksgiving table, is it? It's nearly Thanksgiving, isn't it? I'm not American, as you probably can tell. Um, but I'm pretty sure Thanksgiving is coming up pretty soon. Maybe it's this Thursday. Could be. Let me know if you're American or just if you know. Is, is it like the last Thursday in? November or something like that. I could have completely made that up. I have no idea. <laughs> Let's take a little look. Oh, we've got two of these desks, I think, are LPs. Like a, a posh little office there with the globe in. I love this house. This is really, it really feels like the mayor's house, this, I think. When we go upstairs, we have a duck pond on the balcony. I think that's been glitched in. I don't think you can do that normally without cheating. But I'm not sure. But I think... Um, and what else have we got? Anything? Nothing rare particularly, but awesome build. I might build this, you know. I really do quite like it. And that is what it looks like from the uh, with the roof view. Although when it rains, it's gonna get wet, isn't it? On the yeah, the rain's just gonna go right down into the uh, porch area. But never mind. That is a pretty cool build. So there you go, that completes the tour of all 12 of the new architect homes. Let me know down below if you will be building any of these. I think I definitely will be this time. I am really quite impressed with the build. I think I mentioned in the last video that I was kind of bummed with the architect homes recently, that they've not been very good. But I think these are really, really good builds. Nothing too rare or LP worthy particularly or SP worthy in any of them, but just nevertheless some really good build so let me know if you are building any of them and thank you for watching this video go ahead and give it a thim thumbs thumbs up thumbs i've been talking for too long thumbs up if you enjoyed and i will see you guys soon for a new video bye